Hello everyone, I'm Alice from Guangxi Baixianghui and today I'm going to talk about something about cassia and the cinnamon. Here in front of me, there are four different kinds of cassia and the cinnamon. Can you see? I'll show. They are different in size, length, thickness and the shape. So, what are the difference? Let's talk about it. Here, the first one, uh, it's taken from the tree bark. Uh, it's a little thick and the outer skin is peeled off. So, uh, in Chinese, we call it rou gui. Mm. The quality is quite good and the aroma is strong enough. Now, the second one, this. It looks like the cigarette. We also call it cigarette cinnamon in, my, in our business. Uh, you can stick your coffee, your milk, uh, even your wine by it, right? Mm -hmm. Interesting. And um, this is taken from the branch. So um, uh, it's um, quite um, uh, slim. Now the third one, this, uh, yeah, as you can see, the outer skin is not peeled off. So it's, it looks gray. Uh, this side, the inner side, uh, it's yellow, as, mm. just as the cigarette cinnamon. Uh, for this, we call it broken cassia. Um, you can uh, um, uh, you can press them into the bulk. Uh, actually, we have um, import uh, we have customers uh, buy uh, pressed cassia from us. Um, a broken cassia is low in price, and uh, uh, when you buy it, you can process it further for your end product. Now the last one, uh, this is called the castor tube. It's quite long uh, and the outer skin is not peeled either. You see, um, it looks like this. As our 